here and welcome to my everyday. Today I went shopping and I actually went into a store called Treasure Hunt and I also went into the Dollar Tree. Um, I have to say I was super excited about Treasure Hunt. I've been there a few times. It never disappoints. It's like a liquidation store, like a liquidation outlet type thing uh, where stores that close out uh, send their stuff. And I know you think you get great deals and you might get 20 or 30% off, but I got a lot of stuff for 30, 40, 50, and even 90% off. So I absolutely have to share it with you. So um, let me let me show you what I got. So they put, well, I bought this basket and they put everything in it. So I'm just gonna go through this basket um, and show you what all is in it. I'll try to remember what all I paid for everything because all the prices that are on it are not what I paid. So um, let me just start here. So I got this cute little, um, it's like a flower. It's actually meant to go on like your gifts or something, but I thought it was super cute to put in my daughter's hair. It's made of fabric. Um, the price on it is $3.49, but I paid 79 cents. That I do remember. I also picked up some containers and I know you never think that you can beat the Dollar Tree but um, these were marked at $3 um, and they were actually I believe 30% off so I got them for a dollar eighty and there's one two three four five six of these so I know that usually we can buy these at Dollar Tree and you usually get about three or so in a pack but I got six in a pack for a dollar eighty I also got um, this white container um, and this one was also marked at three dollars I also got it for a dollar eighty but I wanted this one to put in my bathroom under my sink and put my toilet rolls in it so I can put it in my cupboard and then just pull it out and actually have a nice large stock of toilet paper in my um, in my bathroom so another really cool thing that I got is I got these. They look like nail polish. They were in the stationery section and they're actually highlighters. So they were marked at like 331 and I got them for, I believe like 79 cents or something like that, 60 cents. But this is what it looks like. It just looks like a cute little nail polish but it's just a, a highlighter marker and I thought those were super cute. I thought either for myself at my desk or my daughter would probably love them. So I got those because they were super cute and you always need highlighters. I also got this whiteout and it was about 60 cents. Whoops. Um, oh, they had all their Easter stuff on really super cheap which the best part of it is we haven't even had Easter yet so it's very common to see things go on for like 50% off after Easter but this was before Easter so I got these little Easter cup things and I believe this was 30 cents for the different cups and it does come with the little dipper and the tabs to change your egg color and then I also got these um these kits, these egg decorating kits, um, they, this one has 31 items. It's got the silly circles, the egg stands, the dye tabs, um, the egg rounds and fabric pieces and stickers and all that. So I got this one, regular $2, but it was 90% off. So I got it for like 20 cents or 15 cents or whatever it was. This one also was $2.50 regular, 90% off and I did get a third one. I don't need all of these. I'm probably going to be saving them for next year. I actually thought about um, buying a whole bunch and maybe taking them to, I don't know, a homeless shelter with children or some sort of, do some sort of giveaway um, on some, maybe a Facebook page or something. They're just such a great deal. They were all like 15 cents, 20 cents, 25 cents. So I was just in awe at like, how can you turn that down? Especially when usually around Easter, when I'm looking, I'm paying at least like $3, which isn't a lot for something like that either, but to get it for like 20 cents is amazing. So I also got, they had these obviously from Clear Out, regular $29.99 and I got it for $12. It is a bicycle helmet. So it's a car's bicycle helmet. So I thought that was super, great especially with spring coming and the kids wanting to ride their bikes um also got this package of salted sesame sticks 
Um, looks to me like the uh, brand they sell at Walmart, so it must be from one of the Walmart stores that's selling out. The price on it is $3. I got it for $1.50, so that's a good deal. This was a fantastic deal. I got this Simple Sensitive Skin Experts uh, Vital Vitamin Restoring Night Cream, um, and it was priced at $11, and it was 90% off, so I actually got it for a dollar. So I'm just actually going to open up the box. This is what the container looks like. And I did open it up and it doesn't really have a smell, which is good because I have very sensitive skin. I'm actually very sensitive to moisturizers. So I've been trying a whole bunch of different ones just because, um, just trying to see if there's a formula out there that works for me, that doesn't break me out, that doesn't give me some sort of red rash. So I did try I'm gonna try this one. So um, yeah, it was pretty exciting. They had lots and lots and lots of them. So uh, my sister was with me and she did say that this is a good brand, simple. I've never heard of it before, but $11 on sale for a dollar. I thought that was a good deal. Again, I did get a lot of stationary items as well. I got a ton of makeup, so stay tuned for that. Um, they had these cards, regular $12.99. They say merci, which is thank you in French, and I thought those were really great. I like to send thank you cards to my customers, um, so and friends, and whenever you need a thank you card, so I got that. I also got this one here. It's just a plain blank notes, and I did get a third one. This one here, it actually says thank you, and it's got um, the flowers on it, and I thought those were great for spring. Also got this daily agenda, 60 sheets track to do's by person or project. And so basically it's this list, it has a magnet on the back, you can put it on your fridge, and it gives you a day-to-day -day breakdown. It has like the time, and you can name the people in your family um, and keep track of um, what's going on that day, who needs to be where, what appointments everyone has. And then at the very bottom, it actually does have a to-do um, section. So I thought that was pretty handy. And I got this for $1.50. Uh, regular price was $4.99. So I also got these Papermate pens. And they were, I believe, about $0.60. Cents. Um, and they have multiple colors, so I thought that I would try those. Those are neat, I don't know, for me or for my daughter or for whoever, but for 60 cents, you get 15 pens, and Paper Mate's a really good brand, so I got those. Also got this Comfort Grip Cutter Set. It has a bunny um, and a little flower, and I believe this was about, it was 90% off as well, regular price $3.99. So I'm trying to do the math here. I know it was like under a dollar, I think, so. Also got these binder clips, which I also got for about 60 cents. And these mechanical pencil refills, which I got for about 60 cents. Got these highlighters, and I believe they were about 60 cents. And they're Sharpie brand highlighters, and I'm always using highlighters, so I thought that was a good deal. I am saving the makeup for last, so I'm almost near the end here. Um, also got this body pillow cover, and it was $1.50, so I thought that was really pretty. We do have a, bo a body pillow down in my basement on one of the couches, so I thought that's a really nice, pretty pattern. And I did mention I did get this basket. It's a really nice big basket. Um, I actually got it to put on top of a wardrobe that I have in my bedroom that I'm trying to put all of my extra purses into. That way I can just grab it down and grab the purses that I want. If it doesn't work in there, I'll probably put it in my bathroom downstairs and put some extra toilet paper or some towels or something in it. But I thought this basket was amazing. It was regular price, $20.59, and I got it for $12. So I love this basket. So now onto the makeup. They had quite a bit of name brand makeup. Just gonna grab it all here, put the basket down. Um, they had NYX and Maybelline and Rimmel and Elf and a whole bunch of different things. So I'll start off with um, something that I always get and that is the Sally Hansen Salon Nail Effects. 
and I always get these. This is actually one of my favorite patterns. I like to wear it around Valentine's Day because it has the little hearts and the little skulls, but I also like them in the spring or the summer. So I did stock up on these two because I found them. They were a Target clear out and we don't have Target anymore. So I guess all the stuff from Target went to this treasure hunt store and I got each box for $1.99. I know that you can pick those up usually at Dollarama for the same price, but again, I loved this pattern so I had to get it. Um, I also got this lipstick. Now I'm not really sure what brand this lipstick is. I want to say that it is CoverGirl. I'm not familiar with this packaging. Um, there is actually no identifying stamp or anything, but the color is pearl. It said Rogue Expression. So I don't know if that's actually the brand, but anyway, it's 803 Pearl and that's the container. I should actually open and swatch it. I'll do that in a bit. Um, Okay, I also found this NYX. Again, this was Target Clear Out, so they had a whole bunch of NYX um, eyeshadows. So this one is in the color Rust, and I thought that was super pretty. It's definitely a color that I usually gravitate towards. There it is. So I thought I can definitely work with that. They also had um, Another nude matte eyeshadow by NYX. It is Birthday Suit, and this one is still sealed. Let's see if I can open it up. So, this one is in Birthday Suit, and it's just a shimmery white. I think I would use it as like a highlighter. That's the rest from before. There's the Birthday Suit. And then I also got This one called Flamingo. I thought it was really pretty. And that's what it looks like. And it's just very, very light. Try that again. Just right, right there. So I thought those were really, really nice. So NYX eyeshadows, I got them all for $1.99 each. They were Target clear outs. I just have to clean up all the packaging because there's a whole bunch of, whoops. There's a whole bunch of different stickers on them. So that's the makeup that I got. I was super excited. So I spent a total of about $60 after tax at this treasure hunt store and I got all of this stuff. But then right next door, there was a Dollar Tree. So I went into the Dollar Tree and because I had bought so much at the treasure hunt store, I didn't buy a whole lot at um, the Dollar Tree, but I did get a couple food items, mostly things that I had tried before that I wanted to repeat. So I got these go-to snacks, sour cream and onion flavored rings again. I bought them and they disappeared very, very quickly from my house, so I got those again. I also picked up a bottle of Snapple, the peach iced tea, because I love Snapple peach iced tea. It reminds me of when I was a kid. I got a package of planters, roasted and salted sunflower seeds. And a package of toasted corn nuts. I was a little hungry, can you tell? And I got a package of Hershey's Mix. It is Hershey's Mini Milk Chocolate Bars with milk chocolate pretzel bits, um, or bites, roasted salted almonds, and mini pretzels. I have never seen these before. They looked very interesting. Again, as I said, I was hungry, so I thought I'd pick those up. I thought they'd be a really yummy snack. And then the last two things that I got at the Dollar Tree was some scotch tape, because I always need tape, and I like the scotch brand. And the last thing that I got, um, they did have a lot of makeup in the makeup aisle. They actually did have NYX products as well at the Dollar Tree this time. Um, but because I had already been to Treasure Hunt and bought what I wanted, I didn't get anything. But I did get this nail polish remover. Um, they're the little nail polish remover pads that comes 32 pads in this tiny little pod. Um, I got it in the Spring Fresh. They had it in the Peach 
they had it in lavender and they also had it in lemon but I thought this one was good I thought I could throw this in my purse um, especially on days when my nails aren't doing so great then I can quickly clean it up whether I'm in the car or if I'm waiting for an appointment or something it'd be nice to have them in my purse in case of an emergency you never know when you might need to get rid of your nail polish so anyway that's the stuff that I got I just thought that I would share not sure where there are any other treasure hunts um, around again I'm in Can I'm in not I'm in Ontario Canada so we have one uh, not too far away I know there are a few others but if there is a uh, treasure hunt near uh, you I highly recommend going because they had tons and tons of stuff and the clear outs were amazing 90% off I just thought that was amazing now if you don't have a treasure hunt you probably have some sort of liquidation or clear out store and I highly re recommend checking it out I know we tend to gravitate to our dollar trees and our dollaramas and all our 99 cent stores but sometimes you just get a better deal getting name brand products at a large percentage off so that being said I love my dollar store so of course I did have to go into the Dollar Tree um, and I'm always happy when I go there so thank you so much for tuning in and I would love some likes and I would love you to subscribe to my channel uh, feel free to leave a comment down below and I hope to see you again soon talk to you later bye so I just looked up the lipstick because it was bugging me that I didn't know what brand it was from. It's very, very nice. Again, like I said, the color is 803 Pearl and the name on it is Rogue Expression and I had never heard of that before. So I looked it up and actually had a little scare. I thought it was a really good brand, but it actually is a Marcel lipstick. So I guess it's Rogue Expression by Marcel. So, and I did do a little swatch here of the color. That's what it looks like. I'm very happy with it. It's a very, very creamy formula. So again, I paid $1.99 for it and I think that's a super great deal. I think the color is beautiful. So um, yeah, I think I did great.